Today we're doing a tutorial on something a little different. We're going to show you how to set any song as a ringtone. That way you can find your favorite one, download it to your phone, and go ahead and set it exactly as a ringtone. Now we're going to show you how to do this by downloading things off of the internet, basically mp3s, and then switching them over to a ringtone and then just setting them up in the settings and you're all set. Keep in mind, this doesn't work with Apple Music if you're downloading directly from Apple Music. If you use the computer to transfer it to your phone, it would. But you don't really have to worry about this because you can pretty much find any song online for free. Just Google it and find the MP3 and download it. I'm going to show you examples as we go through all this. May sound like a lot, but it's really not difficult. Welcome everybody, I'm Kevin from HelpfulTutorials.net. If you like iPhone tips, tricks, and tutorials, make sure you do a great favor and smack that subscribe button. I would really appreciate it. With that said, let's go ahead and dive in. Here we go, we have everything here. First, we're gonna download a song from the internet. So I already have one that I found here. Nefex is a group that I really like. They're on YouTube. And the cool thing about them is they are copyright free music, which makes this even better. So we're going to choose Best of Me, as I really like that song. We're going to hit the arrow. And I'm going to choose Download. And you want to make sure that it's an MP3. It makes life a lot easier. So let's go ahead and choose Download. You can see it's downloading in the top right in the Download Manager. So now what we want to do is use GarageBand to set it up. GarageBand is a free app. You do not have to pay for it. It is rather large though, so you're going to want to probably pause the video and start downloading it or watch the video as it's downloading and then come back to it then. GarageBand is a sideways app, so we're going to be in landscape mode. So just kind of prepare you for that. Let's go ahead and jump in and hope things don't break. <laughs> there we go. Let's go ahead and choose continue. Continue. All right, so now we're in here. We're going to go to the side and we're looking for audio recorder. There it is. So once you get there, we're going to tap on it. Just click OK on that. We're going to choose the grid. So next, what we want to do is go ahead and bring the song in. So we can do that by pressing on the loop. It's going to go ahead and take you to your files. Let's go ahead and choose files. And you can browse items from the files app. There's the Nefex. We'll go ahead and choose that. It'll just take a moment. Go ahead and select it. That's the one. So now that we have it here, we're just going to tap and hold. And then we're going to drag it to where you want. Now we have that set up. We have to turn off the thing on the top, the metronome. So go ahead and tap that. So first thing we want to do is adjust the length. So we'll hit that plus in the top right corner. And a bar is basically equal to a second. So ringtones can be up to 30 seconds. So let's go ahead and choose 30. And then we'll go ahead and choose done. Now the song is longer. If you want to go ahead and adjust it, just tap on it and you can move this and the opposite side to kind of pinch where you want and then it'll play that type of music. So if you want it like in the middle, you could do that. Also make sure everything's all the way over to the left because if not, you're gonna have blank space in the beginning. Now that we've all done all that, you can play it to make sure. Just go ahead and hit play at the top and you'll be able to hear what you have so far. I have a dream. That's all I need. I'll make it. So now that we have that, what we wanna do is go ahead and hit the arrow in the top left corner choose my songs tap and hold on it and then you're going to scroll down to share go ahead and choose share choose ringtone in the middle it'll basically say it needs to be adjusted so go ahead and choose continue here you can rename it Once you have it renamed to how you want it, go ahead and choose export at the top right. It'll take a moment. I'll come back when it's done. It only took a few seconds. Go ahead and choose OK. Now it's time to set it back up. 
we are done in GarageBand. So now that we're here, we're going to go and choose settings. Then we're going to choose sounds and haptics. We're going to choose ringtone. And there you'll see the new ringtone. You can go ahead and choose it. And now you have the new ringtone all set up. If you're looking for just some free music, some motivational YouTuber the effects, I would shout him out. Search his collection. They have over a hundred songs that they did last year alone. So there's plenty of stuff out there for you. And you can also find stuff that is mainstream, just searching by it. Just make sure you're in Safari, you type download the name of the song and MP3 would be good. But make sure that you do already own it because it's best to do it that way legally. <laughs> I hope this helped for you. If it did, please smack that like and thank you so much for the view.